Good morning everyone, my name is Ashwin Prabhu. This is the fourth tutorial in software defined networking. In the previous video we have discussed about testing of Mininet and RYU controller. Now uh, we are discussing more about Mininet. Uh, so if we type the sudo mn-h uh, it will be like a help option uh, where you can see what all commands we can type while creating the topology. So if the very first thing which you will notice over here is uh, the help option which I just typed in over here and then uh, if you want a switch to be used uh, you can have either of these four options by default it will take uh, the open flow switch and if you want to have a separate switch you can just specify uh, like this sudo mn switch so if I want IVS, so I'll just specify IVS here and it will take this IVS switch. Similarly, you can do it for the other options. You can just specify dash dash controller and then specify. So in the controller part, um, you have an option of either selecting reference controller, a remote controller, uh, Nox controller, or you don't want any controller, you can just specify none. Uh, link, uh, you can have a default link and you can have a TC. Topology, you can while creating topologies, uh, we'll I'll just show it to you topologies in the next video. But for now, um, there are three kind of top three, four, five types of uh, topologies: uh, linear, one is a minimal, then this is a reversed, single, and tree. Apart from this, if you want to have your own topology, you can uh, take the help of this option. So dash dash custom, and then specify the file name dot uh, py file, whichever. Uh, script you have created for making a custom topology. You can specify over here. And in the last video, we have seen sudo mn c option, which will clean the topology and exit. Uh, so, if you want to perform some test on the topology which you have created, you can use the dash dash test command. With this, what it will do is uh, you can specify what you want to do with the topology. So, if I for example, if I do a ping call command, I'll just show it to you at once. So, sudo dash dash test ping call. So, what it will do is it will create a default topology um, uh, with two hosts and one switch, and it will ping all the servers. So, once it is pinged, uh, and if the ping is successful, it will show the results to you, and the topology will be exited. I just run this so you can see the net topology is being created the ping command is successfully achieved and once it is successful it will stop the controllers it will so it's like uh, exiting from the topology so with this you can have different options along with the topology creations so what uh, minus x command here will do is it will form x term for each node. Suppose there, suppose is suppose in um, mean suppose in sudo mn command. Um, basically here there are two host, one switch, and one controller. So if I do sudo mn minus x, what it will do is it will open an x term for each of these nodes after creation. So a topology is created here. And here you can see that it is creating a separate window for each of these. So you can connect host one directly, host two, switch S1, and a default controller will be there. So controller C0. So like that, various options are there. I'll just exit this topology again. Oh sorry. I'll exit it and then I'll clean this. So this is what minus x will do. Uh, then it is the Mac which will automatically set host Mac addresses. Um, so if you don't set this option what it will do is it will take Mac addresses, random addresses. And if you set this option it will take 
addresses and put it in a numbered format so it will be in a sequence so if there are two hosts the first host will have a MAC address of 1 the second host will have a MAC address of 2 and so on uh, this is the verbosity while we create a topology so if you don't specify anything it will just give us the general information so if you want to see um, more detail about it you can just specify a warning critical so what it will do is while creation of the mininet it will show us the debugging steps it will provide us more information about that creation of topology uh, so for now these are the most important things uh, which you have to understand um, apart from this if you want to know something more specific you can open the mininet.org file on the net and then you can <coughs> read more about that so this was a basic uh, options we have while creating topology next we are going to discuss about the mainnet commands which you can use so this was it for the fourth video in the next tutorial we will discuss more about mainnet commands thank you for listening have a good day